food and life is such a beautiful thing don't you think so if you guys are enjoying this content don't forget to subscribe here like this content click on the bell you're part of the notification okay. and guys what is your favorite meal put it down below there because on Sunday I will match for you ram draw this Sunday will be I think you should make your best apple pie from Tembo. All right, Temple, you gotta do me like this. You know I'm not a baker, guys, but I think I can bake an apple pie. Chop me something. Let's say this, should you guys trust my baking skills? <laughs> Don't worry, guys, I baked this back in grade seven. <laughs> Our pastry crust. I know this pastry crust because it's pretty much similar to a biscuit crust without the baking soda. So two cups of flour, quarter teaspoon of salt, I'm gonna mix that in. I got one cup of shredded cold butter. Once I got that grated, here I have half a cup of ice cold water, which we're just gonna add in slowly, guys. Slowly and mix. Once you got your dough nice and rolled out, all we're gonna do is take this dough, pop it in the fridge for the time being. Next, I got five Granny Smith apples here, which I'm just gonna skin. Be careful with this part, guys, because you will slice your finger if you go this speed. Trust. <laughs> as I always do. All right, once you got that nice and peeled, I'm gonna hack these, core this with a spoon. Nothing to it now. Chop it down. To our sliced apples, I got two tablespoons of melted butter, half teaspoon of ginger powder, one teaspoon of cinnamon, half teaspoon of nutmeg, pinch of salt, half a cup of brown sugar. Take your beautiful clean hand, give that a mix, guys. Once you got that nice and coated, let's roll out our dough. So watch closely, guys. Karate chop, beautiful, guys. This can't be taught, guys. <laughs> All right, so we got these two halves, so one for the bottom, one for the top. Just gonna roll this out into a nice round. Pretty much just want to fit this glass bowl. So I got that nice and rolled out to my perfection. I'm trying to place it on top. And get out as much air bubbles pockets as possible. Throw in our apple pie filling. Don't goof guys, forgot to Clean the access. This is why I need a baker, guys. I got no time. I got no time to bake. Shout out to my future baker wife out there. <laughs> I know she's just baking away, guys. She's just baking her heart out. I'll meet you one day. <laughs> Take our top. Throw it on top. Simple as that, guys. Take your top, throw it on top. I'm gonna pat it in. Push out as much air as I can. Take my roller, roll out the excess. After that, I'm gonna take two fingers and I'm just gonna pinch each side, guys. Just making it more aesthetic. Last but not least, let's make some apple pie air hose. I'm gonna throw my egg wash on top just to help the color. into the oven at 375 for 45 to 50 minutes. 50 minutes up, you got your nice warm apple pie. So I'm just gonna let this sit for 30 minutes before we cut into it. 30 minutes is up guys, get your pie scooper. <laughs> and we're just gonna break into it. Nice. 
Not too shabby. You cannot have apple pie without vanilla ice cream. All you gotta do is take your <laughs> ice cream scooper. Just dollop on there. There it is. Your homemade apple pie. Let's get into this, guys. I don't bake much, but this apple pie looks fire, guys. Crispy crunch. Crust, I mean. I get a whole big bite for you guys. Guys, apple pie. Quick time. Nice guy. Nice. Does my apple pie reign supreme? A pump. <laughs> That's a good apple pie. Shout out to my grade seven foods class teacher for teaching me how to make this. The crust is crumbly, delicious, warm, sweet. The vanilla just complements it a bit with a nice cold, creamy taste to this. Mm. The crust is perfect, guys. Mm. Flaky, just like a biscuit, but more hard. Just because there's no baking soda in it. Braddy Kitty's up. Braddy Kitty, you know I hear you. Mmm. Some with apple pie. You gotta have a whipped topping or vanilla ice cream on top. That's what makes it. Mmm. What I like about this, guys, is pretty much the apples. The apples are very nice and tart. And the sugar and everything just works out so well. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Apple pie for breakfast. You can't go wrong. <laughs> Braddy Kitty, come here. I heard you. You just want a little attention, Kitty. You just want a little attention. <laughs> you just want a little attention, huh, you little brat? Hi, huh, you little brat? Say good morning. Good morning. Look at you. You always wake up with the bed hair, huh, kitty? We sleeping good every day, huh, kitty? You little brat. <sighs> I'm not much of a sweet person in the morning, but still all good. <laughs> Mm. I want to see what I can fill with this later on or use this crust just to fill something else with it maybe blueberry I love blueberry pie Mm. Just perfect. If you guys got some tips on how to keep these apples not as brown as this, please do put it down below. Maybe I put too much cinnamon. That's the reason why I turned brown. Maybe I should just undercook it a bit more. But I don't know. Any tip will be greatly appreciated, guys. Food and life is such a beautiful thing, don't you think? Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Don't forget to subscribe if you have it. Also, don't forget to pick up one of your food and life's a beautiful thing. Shirts. Like, <laughs> shirts. Peace out.